Welcome to Awakening You channel. If you appreciate what we do, please support us. Thank you. Dear sons and daughters of planet Earth. I am Sananda. Once again, and I will never tire of saying, it is with great joy that I come here, once again today. Today I want to deal with a slightly complex subject, but I guarantee you that it is very simple, believing. What is believing? There are several ways you can find to believe in something, the main one is to see it happen. Because when you are fully aware of the fact happening, it is more than enough reason for you to believe. And especially if you see the origin of how it was triggered and how it happened, then it's perfect. You just need to repeat exactly what was said, what was done and everything will happen exactly as you saw. It will be. So I'll give you the usual example, you take a recipe, add all the ingredients, prepare it exactly as directed, and wait for the result. Some come out exactly as shown and at this point you feel accomplished, because you were able to reproduce exactly what was said. But there is that other group, whose result was not as expected. Why? If you followed the instructions given exactly, why did it turn out differently? I answer, because it had its energy there. In that whole process you put your energy into it, and your energy was not an energy of success, it was that energy of doubt. Ah, will I be able to do it? Will I make it? And exactly what you achieved was proportional to what you believed. So realize that even though you see the preparation, the process, and the end, it is never guaranteed that the same thing will happen in your lives, because there are many components there. Of course, I'm not here talking about simple things, about mixtures that can't go wrong. I'm talking about more complex things, where you need to have all the knowledge, however small, to be able to make them happen. So simply looking, seeing the result, doesn't mean that when you try to do it, it will come out the same way. Because each of you has a way, has a way, has a belief, has a confidence, or not. And these factors are added to and others to give the result. The events in your world are not mathematical formulas, some of which give only one result. But there are also mathematical formulas, which result in various results. So realize that nothing is limited, that nothing is always completely correct. Believing, believing by seeing, is a way of making them believe that they will also succeed, but it is not a guarantee. So what do you need to have? You need to have the confidence and certainty that you have the ability to produce the result you want. And then I'm talking about everything, not just what you see happening, but about anything. The energy that you put into trust, faith, certainty of a 100% satisfactory result, adds a lot to that process, proportionally improving the result in relation to your belief. So realize that there is no point in imitating others. Yes, you can have the recipe ready in your hand, that recipe that you saw made and everything turned out well. But you did it and it didn't turn out as you expected. First of all, never think of yourself as a failure. Maybe there is a lesson there, as if telling you, you need to have more focus, you need to believe more, you need to love what you are doing. And you will try again, and another, and another, until one day you will achieve that wonderful result that you had seen. So this is also a learning experience, it is the way for you to overcome each obstacle that appears. Now let's talk about another belief, it's the belief that you can't catch, you can't see, you just hear someone tell it, hear someone say it. How to believe, how to be sure that you will succeed. If you don't have the ingredients, you don't have the way to do it, you don't have anything, you just have someone saying, look, do it and you'll do it. How then to believe, how then to make it happen? I have nothing to hold on to, how am I going to make this happen? So right now is where the key factor in all of this comes in, trust. But not trust in whoever told you, it's trust in yourself, it's trust that you're capable of doing it. Ah, but I don't know how to do it. When you have the confidence, 
as if by magic, the way, the ingredients, the process appear in front of you, they are shown to you crystal clear. And if you continue to believe in yourself, the reaction begins and the result will come later. Yes, we cannot say here that the result will be immediate. It's not like that recipe that you make and after a while, it's ready. No, in these cases you will do it, you will repeat it, you will do it again, one more time, and you will do it n times, until you get the result. And what can you do to speed up these n times? Trust, believe, have greater awareness, that you are a powerful being and that you have the ability to do whatever you want, as long as this experiment is good for you, first and foremost, and good for the whole. So I tell you, that everything that brings you joy, everything that brings you victory, everything that brings you satisfaction is good for the whole, because you emanate this, and by emanating you modify the whole. So let's believe, let's trust that you are powerful beings. It's like I said, it's not today for you to imagine that something will appear in front of you, that you will be able to materialize whatever you want in front of you. But I guarantee, if you try one, two, three, n times, and more and more, put focus, put wisdom, put faith, put certainty and trust, one day you will see what you want in front of you. Only depends on you. You often put the accomplishment of things on us. We are asked. Ah, I ask this, to whatever being of light, to father or mother God, it doesn't matter, and settles down there. I already asked, now let them run after me. Once again I will remind you, we do nothing. Yes, we do, when you take the first step, when you put yourselves into the elaboration of what you are asking for, when you are believing what you are asking for, when you are doing your part. Then yes, we give that little push to help them. But why? Because you did what you did, you trusted your own strength too, you didn't leave everything to us. So everything you ask for and do nothing, you get nothing. Because just you doing what is necessary in your world to achieve this, we will do it here, in our world, to help you. So you don't want everything to happen with our intervention. You have to take the first step and all the steps forward so that we can see that you are making an effort, then yes, we will help you. So what is believing? Believing is not believing in the being of light, it is not believing in Father or Mother God, it is believing in yourself. You have the power in your hands, you are capable of anything. No, don't tell me you aren't because you made this world the way it is. If you had no power, nothing that exists in your world today would have been created. You would still be living in paradise, because you would not have the strength to modify what God the Father or Mother created. So you do have power, and a lot of it. You just need to believe, believe this, that you have power. Now start using this power for the positive, for the good of the whole, for the good of yourselves. Change the focus, forget the problems, take the focus off the problems. The focus has to be on what you want, not on the problems. Everything you focus on unfolds, happens. So if you focus on problems, you only attract more of the same. Now if you focus on the solution, on growth, on joy, on happiness, this also reverberates and this also comes back. And problems over time become small, they become almost meaningless. And you won't even realize how quickly those problems that seem to have no solution, seem to have no end, were resolved and you practically did nothing, you just changed your focus, believed that you were capable of creating a new path for yourself, focusing on the good things, on what you want, not on the problems. Believing is focusing, but focusing on the power, the power to change, the power to transform, the power to accomplish, that each of you has.